boy. Well, that's all took way, way longer than it should have done, folks, and I apologise. Still in the process of threading cables through places and setting monitors up and getting things sorted out to the way they want them to be. I still don't have the screens where I want the screens to be. It's it's frustration, but it just makes things difficult. I can't plan enough time to get things done. Hello, Riddler. Hello, Wilkie. Hello, Arrow. Hello, Bald Ego. Hello, Magnus. Welcome. I'm just about to get the uh, server up, and we'll we'll get rocking and rolling. What's made things difficult tonight is I've just mounted a 55-inch TV. <laughs> up on the wall above my PC. The last addition to the room until we get the final bits of the rig in place. Then having shelves wrapped out at the weekend. I think we've got the screen on, haven't we? We can see everything. Yes, we can. See me doing everything I shouldn't be doing. Uh, can I hear headphones? That's the... I don't know if I can hear stuff in the room, whether it is my headphones, change car, outside in the room. It is, it's coming through the TV across the other side of the room, I've got to
I am trying to paint. Oil. Oh, what happened, Bald Eagle? Did you actually manage to get that decent one? Or are you uh, still struggling? Good evening, Fat Man. Welcome. I apologise, guys. I'm on it. I'm on it. I don't want my oil to go bad during the race. It's going to be bad enough having... Gonna be bad enough having my controller go offline whilst we're mid mid apex of a corner. But at least I get the car to move along whilst I'm whilst I'm doing it. So fifteen minutes late. I think we can go to the track a little bit later. It's finals night anyway, isn't it? But let's get the server set up. Get you boys on track, get you practicing and warming up. And what I'm supposed to do at this point. Let's click on to one of our sponsors adverts so I'm going to do that just while I get things done so as you all know I'm I'm supported by GT Amiga I'm an affiliate with them and I'm just going to run one of their adverts don't forget you can go to their store and today they have launched 12 new products for the Prime and Prime Light rig which I will talk about later it is the last one and uh, there's some things on there that I fancy buying so let's check out one of their adverts and we'll go from there says as he presses the button did it actually flick back to me yes it did there we go so what GT Amiga did today was launch a dozen new products associated with the rig various different ways to mount the pedals and seat mounts to allow me to tip the seat back and get a more touring car position servers up chaps I've become much, much, much more disorganised. But, hey ho. BB says you probably won't make it in time. Yes, you will if we wait for you, BB. We'll wait for you, my friend. It's the final night of the GR4s. When you come in the door, we'll go to qualifying. We'll give you a couple of laps. Don't worry about it. Now the race always starts about 21.30 ish UK. We start qualifying about quarter past, but we'll delay it a little while. Let's get. And then we'll do. Got a couple of things to do tonight. I've big poppers prepared, pre-prepared some uh, some league charts to show where we are before we go into the final race. Good. Good evening, Matthew. Good evening, Sam. Good evening, Bish. Hi, Scampster. It's a bit too warm for the red shirts, unfortunately. 
Um, I've got a window open, I've got a fan on, and it's not, it's too much, the old red tops. So I, we're just taking a little sabbatical from the red tops for a couple of days. I haven't got time. I haven't got time to get everything done. I'm working an hour further away from home. So I get home an hour later. I've got a puncture tonight. I've, it's all going wrong on my world. But hey, hey, moan, moan. So. This race is going to be extremely difficult. I've just seen the karting track Wilkie talked about. It was there in the distance. Assist, traction control one, weak ABS, ASM off, you can tell what I was doing last night. Roller steering sensitivity set to zero. Force feedback max torque five, force feedback sensitivity one is what I've been told to go to. We will see. What tyres do? Yeah, it's the final night of the league. Do I do I talk about my oh happy birthday, happy birthday, Mister Mister Bald Eagle? Steering's really heavy. On nine newton of, of steering. I don't know if that's too much, but it's the default. What I find is it goes slower when the wheel's heavy. Oh, and Sam, I wasn't too overly excited about somebody beating you. It's just the first time I've ever seen anybody beating you recently. So it just got a little bit emotional, but... I then got messages from the person who was, Cavs, saying how hard he tried to get to beat you. He's, uh, he's pretty quick anyway, Cavs. So, uh... He's a good racer, so all props to him. If you've gone out and whooped it, then all well and good. Yeah. I got within 0.17 of my fastest time on, on the uh, time trial that's finishing this week, last night. I thought I'm. I th yeah, I thought I might get somewhat close, and I thought I might beat it, but no chance. Wow. That's the one how we feel.
guess not. That's where I think we are tonight though, I think it's a hard tyre race. I think I think if you're pitting every three laps on medium, it's going to be a right nightmare. Unless you try and burn mediums bed. Oh absolutely, it might be thought. It's the heat. It's got to be the heat, and it. It's got to be the heat. Yeah, just keep driving till you hit the wall. So we're going to wait and hang on for BB tonight, folks. Now he's estimated to land for half past nine, so we'll start quali when BB arrives. I just want to get him included because it is the last week of the race, last week of the league. Stefan's made it. Welcome, Stefan. And uh, my commit. I, I just have to pass on my thoughts to your friend, my um, buddy. Uh, a sad loss. I'm sorry to hear about that. Yeah. I just, just, just on the same sort of vein. I lost a close friend in a river rafting accident as well. So it's it's far too common. Far too common. It's a very dangerous activity, and I don't think people realise just the consequences of how surging that water is. Even the, even the most confident and capable of swimmers will struggle in a, in a white water situation. It's very, yeah, yeah. JB. No problem. Riddler looks like he's joining us tonight. Welcome, Mr. Riddler. First time, or oh, second time, isn't it? That's right. Absolutely.
Wasn't it meatloaf? Is it Jim Carrey? Off by a Magnus. A tea towel. Or a microfiber cloth. Yeah, microfiber or similar. Microfiber is a better example, isn't it? Dishwasher. That's true. There's a punchline coming, isn't there? Yeah, there we go. Yeah, it's true. I think the only good thing about today is there's a short pit stop. Relatively short. But I think I think the race the race is gonna be won outside of the pit lane, if that makes sense. You can stay out of the pit lane, you're gonna win this race. I think. Yeah, but is that all soft tyres though? Is that all softies? Yeah. Welcome Big Popper. Welcome Magnus. Can't remember. That was uh, Sphinx's line, wasn't it? What are you doing? I can't remember. Five laps on mediums, that's shockingly bad, isn't it? That's where I'm going now. I last longer with my missus. How's the football going? Slippery. You know, mate, I, I'm 100% sure that Arsenal aren't going to be playing in this final. 100% sure. Probably 3-0 down. I'll check the football score in a minute, see what Slippery's uh, thinking. See if somebody will. Wilkie says he wants to see if somebody will do a jump into the pit lane. We'll, we'll have to see, won't we? We'll have to see. We go for some hot lap practice. See what we can do on these softies. There is the uh, brake balance is in the middle for now. 
that's where it's got to be. Probably the worst track in the world to have as the final week. I hate Kai 25 has been getting. No, nope, I haven't. I don't know what he's been up to. I'm Maybe that's what uh, Gamp is referring to. Arsenal 1, Bayern 2. Oh my lord. That's probably about where it needs to be. That's probably how it will finish and then we'll bring it home and win 2-1 at home and go to penalties. We're at home as well, are we? Oh, that's a shame, but I have to go away to win. That will struggle. We're normally fortunate getting away draw, but we haven't, have we? Kane, Kane scored. Oh my word! Penalty. We gave a penalty away. Ah, poor fools. So for anybody that is not in the league tonight, you must appreciate that you don't get points for your place. And if you finish, say for example, third, you won't get demoted from the position, you just won't pick win points for the position. Because the points are going to the guys in the league. So I hope that's understood and is satisfactory so I'm going to get three laps I'll probably do qualifying on this set of socks got to go to a stint again on doesn't matter about the fuel does it doesn't matter about the fuel we know where that's going he's a real bully on the track I don't know I think Sam gave him his uh, his dues but the I can, I can be critical of Kai just as Kai could be critical of me, but from a professional point of view, he, he has a place that he is and I think he's a decent racer, but I don't know, I just don't, I don't see it as warranted to attack somebody, but if it's done in fun and it's all fair and and nice and pleasant but if it's not it's a little bit out of order isn't it? it's it's taking the mick out of somebody because of making himself an easy target kind of thing oh yeah I've just done exactly the same thing Stefan I apologise for getting in your way I've just lost my wheel as well this widow maker just Careering through. Yeah. 
I think it's a little bit unfair if it if he can't retaliate. If, he can't. if it is as it's said that they've got a website or a YouTube channel of their own and they're just ripping the pee out of him, it's a little bit. It's bad. Yeah. It, Yeah, so if he's if he's found a way to get views on YouTube purely by doing that, that's a little bit dirty, that's a little bit wrong. YouTube should be stopping that. But it's Right, that good. You're an easy target though when you're in this seat, you know, it's... I don't know how I'd react if somebody... Well, any any media is good media, you know, if, you, if it's promoting his channel in some way or another, you know, if it's promoting people to watch him in some way, or whether it's... whether it's a negative thing, I don't know, it's... he's got to be strong to be able to resist it, so... Like I say... Of course you will. Of course you will. There's only a couple of tools a YouTuber's got to stop it, and I've unfortunately haven't had to have any sort of need to do that. Wow. I know somebody in Ireland if you need them. They're really nice people as well in Ireland. Really nice. Hey, blind shooter zombies. I wanted to say thank you because of your videos are fun to beat many books. 47, 48, 49. Is there more after 49? Not yet, my friend. No, once you get 49, you're onto the extra menu books, which are just the collector ones. And then you get on to go on and do all the other things like circuit experience, time trials, etc, etc, so... Have I? Not... Not according to my screen, I haven't. I'll... Ah, no, 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 it's because I was on, uh, it was because I was an auto drive. I was just resetting my wheel. Hopefully it's a week away before that fix is here. been 
patrolling for over two years, Christ alive. Or he's been taking the piss for two years. They've eased off the penalties there, haven't they? It looks like I'm going to get 10 laps out of my set of hards. <laughs> Haven't seen JB yet. Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah, he's up there. And they're done. Oh my, I don't know what's gone on there. My steering wheel's still working, but the throttle just went. Seem to have penalties racking up, so We don't make a bit silly. That's what Wilkie wanted to see. But, but probably during the race. Probably didn't want to see it in practice. Oh, sorry, Magnus. drive the GT40 around this. Thought he drove the uh I might have been. what did he race in the first race? It was a um, an MGA. Yeah, it was the It was an MGA in the first race, wasn't it? The white one. I watched it last time on the plane going to the States. I watched it twice. I thought, oh, there's inspiration for GT7. I'll see if I can make a movie. And no, do you know how much plumbing work that is? France.
Was he paying um, Carol Shelby? Or who was he playing? Opposite, he was the um, protagonist, was he? That's right, it was Matt Damon, you're right, yes. Born. Good day, Magnus. You take care, buddy. People are watching them though, aren't they? That's the problem, Wilkster. It can only do... I think that can only do Kai a level of worth. He's got to make of it what he can. Right, it's 21. I'm going to do introductions. No, so if I got this right, safety rating goes up being a good driver and not bumping and going off course. Yes, the drive rating is by getting better final positions. Absolutely right. You've got to finish above mid place and above better rated drivers than you are to get your driver rating to go up. You finish below midway and you've got worse drivers finishing in front of you, then it's going to go down. Yeah, I've got the Sauber C9. I certainly have Ambush. Welcome to the channel. We've got 10 on the track and one more to come. So let's just have a little spectate. There's Samster in the Porsche. Batman just enjoying a bit of dust. I thought he was lining up to do a pit entry then. That man should go pretty well today. Big Popper. Sitting in third place in the current standing. I think he's going to do well here today. Local track. One that he should do well at. Seems to do well at all the US courses. More than so. JB with a new skin. For the final event. Trying to make out the sponsors. M H A. I thought it was, yes. That's what it says underneath. Currently being chased down by Stefan. There he is, number 68, JB, as is in fifth. going to go and look at the uh, positions for the league in a moment showing you there Riddler in sixth place Bald Eagle in seven a very gold looking livery very American in his American car Stefan showing us what the dust can do to the car behind and Bish Bish has been off a couple of weeks but he's back he can be fast as he just shows us the line through the dust there by the pit lane. There's Widowmaker in the pits. As has gone to the pits, and Sam. Let's go and uh, let's go and have a look at the league positions. The way we're going to do this is go into the chat. I'm just going to close the chat off a minute. Can't see that. Then I'll bring it back up because there's a bit of chat gone on today that probably shouldn't be aired. Then I've got to go back up to where the chat was. We'll find that in a moment. There's so much chat going on. Here we go. GR4 after series 5. So as you'll see here folks, Sam is currently leading the league with with five weeks complete you can see the points has already dropped one round from everybody so sam's clearly way out from perfect score fat man in second just as he is today on the timing chart slippery bandit is not with us tonight because he's watching 
the football. No worries, BB. Not sure what you mean about recommending qualifying before. Well, the thing about qualifying is that that will get you further up the grid. If you're fast enough to overtake everybody, you don't need to start from the back. But here's the thing. Your first five races, you go into a lower ranked league. So if, you, if you're just starting out and you've done no online races, your first five races is your opportunity to shine. Go out there, set yourself the fastest qualifying you can for your first five races. Pick a race that you know you can be good at and go and do really, really well. Because you'll get put into a new starters league for the first five races. And go out and score as high as you possibly can. Get first and seconds, thirds in your first five races. And that will get you to the next rank and your first full fledgling races. It's only after those first five races do you then need to really worry about what you're going to do. If you're going to hit the qualifying and you're going to hit it hard and you're going to try and get up into the qualifying places, get further up, you need to get about halfway for you to be able to then claw your way through and get higher. If you're not that fast, then you're doing the right thing. You're doing the right thing. If you've got one more race to go, make sure you do well in that one. Get as far up D as you can and try and get to S as soon as you can. But then, you're really in the dogfighting world of D's and C's. Once you get through C's and you get to B, it gets better. I have never got to A. I probably won't ever try to get to A, to be honest, because it just does me head in. But just finish as high as you can every time. Qualifying is only important if you're not fast enough to overtake everybody. So, sorry, just going back to the league standings. So Slippery Bandit is there, he's not with us tonight, so that's going to be his final scoring positions. JB on 58, he would have to score higher points in this, well he's going to take all the points from whatever he scores in this race, and looking at how fast he is here, he's going to really be challenging to get above Slippery, definitely. BB is going to try and join us, he's going to take all the points from this race, whatever he scores, but he's a long way behind JB. So I think BB's probably going to finish fifth. Or at least, well, I would hope he was going to do well. Big Popper has got a good opportunity. But if you look at the next four races, Big Popper, Love It, Love It, I don't think. Is Love It with us? I don't think Love It's going to make it. So Love It's going to finish on 44. As is on 43. And Widow's on 42. So it really is dog eat dog between. BB, Big Popper, Love It, As and Widow. And I've got the biggest challenge to do there. Mr. Ball isn't joining us tonight. So any of those five races could really finish fifth. Dependent on qualifying and results. Bald Eagle needs a little bit of a step up. He's finishing below at the bottom of the table. But he's, he's only his first season. And Bish has been out a couple of weeks. So no drama there. Yeah, you lose rating because of where you finish, unfortunately. But the idea is to get through those five races and get on. But that's where we are. That's where we're going to start for race six. All the points in this race count. Unless, of course, it's less than the round that was dropped. So if it's less than the round that was dropped, well, we'll have to see. So we're just waiting on the BB, who should be with us anytime soon. Hopefully he's going to say hello to the wife and family before he jumps on. Good stuff, Blind Shooter. That's exactly what you need to do. Enjoy it. Right, car settings, softs, the qualifying. It's three laps, isn't it? One minute twenty. Oh, 
I don't know whether it's going worth going mediums. Sorry, fat man. I was out of control at that point. Lobby racing, I, I, those daily races just boil my urine. I, I can't find any any passion at all to race with that bunch of muppets that race on their daily. I just have nothing for it. I I can't find any motivation to go out there and get door slammed or smashed up on the first corner. It happens every. I know, but it's. I I have. Until they fix the penalty system, I have, and and I mean by fixing the penalty system, I mean banning people for, for just despicable driving. The only people that get banned are those people that retaliate against those people that smash each other off. And it does me in. <laughs> yeah, that's the way it is. That's how it works. But I, I have no no desire to even have to try and prove myself for an A rating because it, it's just too much heartache and pain. It really is. I I have no. where I ended up just a minute ago. I just missed my breaking point, hit one of those signs. I was done. Nobody... Yeah. Did you end up between the orange bales and the yellow bales? Yeah, that's where I was. That's how you make your perfect entry into the pit lane. That's the line for the jump into the pits. On the BB. Where are you, man? No speeding fines, just get here. Two, two, Arsenal. How long left, Wilkes? Can't be long, they start early, don't they, on the Euro games? That was a great game, 15 minutes left. We might as well wait for Slippery as well at this point. Oh, I don't know the name, but tell us the game. What did you have to do?
Right. Never heard of that. Now, your team are beating Madrid. Who's your team, Mr. Wilkesley? You're going to be a City fan. That's Stefan. Stefan's backing off. Yeah, City, yeah. It's a shame you're not going to win the league this year. I think it could be any of them. Sorry. It could be any of them three from the front. I thought Arsenal had the uh, season ticket most of your life. Christ alive. I thought uh, I thought Arsenal had the hardest run in with with Manu and Tottenham to face. Yeah, it make me all going to watch City every week, mate. Sorry, that's unfair. What the hell's Garden skipping? What's garden skipping when it's at home? Run that. Send the pigeon. Yeah. I can tell you a story about that where I got arrested. Yeah, I regret that. Work some of those machines, yes. Yeah, it did, yeah. Went to the first game at the age of three. Wow. Stop giving people ideas. BB's in. BB's in, folks. Right, I'm going to reset my wheel, and by the time by the time the wheels reset, I'm just seeing BB running that. Yes. <laughs> Doing my wheel. And then we're going to go to qualifying, folks. City's three all at Madrid now. Oh my god, there's some good games tonight. <laughs> it's not true. It's totally different to driving a G29 or any other wheel. The the pedal control is completely different.
Right, folks. Ready to go to qualifying. Get your qualifying ties on. Right then, 10 seconds, gentlemen. It will put you to the back of the grid if you don't set a time, yes. It's really... It's good of you to join us, PB. Might as well change the tyres while I'm here. I just caught the inside curb and it just flicked me off to the left. It's like, oh, okay, well done. I was just reaching over to adjust my brake balance and just took my eyes off where I was going. Fish.
as he's going for the big jump. Not seeing Popper on the list anyway. Oh, there he is, there he is. I'd have worried then that Popper had missed qualifying or something. So that's made things the way they're going to be. As has got the biggest benefit coming out of qualifying by the looks of it. Unless he can do something at the end here. No, nope, there he is, fourth place. Tassan takes it, Fat Man second, JB third. Let's just quickly nip to the results. Take a screenshot. Yeah, sorry, it's a little bit late starting, folks. I'm just going to quickly nip to the gents and we'll make a start. Oh, unlucky, Big Papa, unlucky. I haven't had a purpose. No, I haven't. Have a job. I had a numero uno. No worries, Ridley. You take care, my friend. All the best. So, Riddler's left us. Right, gentlemen, have you got your race tyres on? 
I'm just about to. So the person that said they didn't see what the standings were, I did a full rundown of the standings with the league on screen about three minutes before we went to quali. No, but you can... The best thing, look, to finish the, the statement off, if you want to watch it back, you'll fight, you'll see it. Yeah, cool. Right. Gentlemen, it's the final round. Best of luck. Lots of places to be made between 5th, 6th, 7th and 8th. So, that 5th... Yeah. We'll see where we go. Good luck, gentlemen. Just make sure we've got things where we're going, yes. Don't forget it's a standing start. And penalties will be applied. And I'm going to mute. Mm. With that being the case, folks, there are people out there listening to the stream and understanding what my strategy will be. My strategy is no different to anybody else's. It's going to be hard, I think, all the way. We started mid-pack because of where we finished in fifth place. Oh, there's a little bit of aggression down the inside. Big Popper came off worse there. Here comes Fat Man absolutely charging. And I think maybe the wise words were that he would be on mediums when everybody else is on hards. Look, you can tell that look. Go down the right side of Stefan here, see if he just acknowledges that I'm there. He knows I'm there now. Stefan went to the gravel. I hope that wasn't a touch from me. I'm going to stay left and give Fat Man the outside line. make that deeper than what I did. Sam's going to come through and pick that up. I'm much slower through that line than they are. Big Popper's managed to recover ground and get back on track. He's quicker than me off that corner, so he's going to pick up that inside line. I'm going to give that up. I'm not going to block it. It doesn't seem to be any point. It's early days. Backfire from Big Popper's car there. Probably could have gone down a fourth. Batman just isn't pushing to get past Bish at this point. the Porsche race at the front lot, all three of them. Bish was beset with problems through qualifying. Penalty is just he's just gone wide off the track, which is what he was doing in the early part of qualifying. Let's see 
if we can dive up the inside. I think he might be suffering with tyres already. It's just... The longer we can make the tyres last, we've got the fuel. I still think it's just going to be 15 minutes. I don't think we'll get a two-stopper out of it. the heat of the day that makes these tyres cook. We were very close to uh, having an incident there. I don't want to be off the track. Yeah, the hot air balloons look great, don't they? Popper looking incredibly fast, look at him. So on to lap five, tyres half done. We're only just six minutes, five and a half minutes into the race. This is not looking good. I've got to be very careful around that final corner. Ste is that Stefan coming back? Or is that JB? It's JB. Just slowing down here. Sam has made it past Fat Man. Big Popper's there, just, just in the catbird seat, waiting to bounce. This is the corner I'm not enjoying. This is so difficult. Mess that up. Didn't realise JB was trying to squeeze a pass down the outside as well. Ooh, has a. He made car all dirty, man. We're down to sixth place, so we've lost a place from qualifying. this my wheels cut out which we know was always going to be a problem for me Places, two places because of it. That's us in. Are we in last place? No, we're not. But hey ho. 
want to do three more laps, but I don't think the tyres are going to take it. It's only 12 minutes, three more laps. Is somebody off? Yeah, somebody's off. That's Big Popper. Oh, such a shame. He was pushing at the front there. And Bald Eagle goes to the grass. I say grass. That's a personal life choice. But Come on, Big Pete. Come on. Push, 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 push. Let's not fight. Let's chase him down. Come on. even done 12 minutes and the hard tyres are gone Big Pop was on mediums holy chipotle I guess his mediums burnt out fairly quick. And he's been on red a couple of laps, I would suggest. the tyre, I wonder if I can, can I just keep running, no stop, just keep running, all the way, no pit stops, or at least 20 laps, let's get that right front down to nothing. black stuff and I keep it rolling
that man's on the mediums as well. We did know that. The fat man's in and out. Ten laps is just over half a tank of gas. Big Popper just slid on by as we went, Mr. Drifter. BB's gone to the pits. I think JB's doing the same as me. JB's in a four-wheel drive car as well. He was in a front-wheel drive car. No, I think it's four-wheel. As is up to second, he's going to be pushing those tyres. to the 15 minute mark Sam's gone in he's on 35% fuel what are we on we're on 41 so Big Popper's just got past JB as is leading JB's gone in. Our chances of doing a one stopper are pretty remote. We would have had to have gone fuel map two. BB's chasing us down though. Well, well done, Slippery. Hards were screwed after nine laps. Mr. Scamster. We're going to make them pay, though. I'm going to go full Yorkshire on these. I'm going to get my money out of them. There goes BB. one more lap and I should be able to pit I'll be on target for a two stopper
Completely not the right strategy. Batman's out front again. As is just catching us now. What do we want to take? Fifteen laps of fuel? Yep. Fifteen laps. Happy days. Come on. Resigned to the fact that this season is pretty, pretty poor. There we go. Coming out. Fish is now chasing us down. Just not me. Oh, come on. Brand new tyres. Don't know why it wouldn't slow down. Probably because I didn't change down. I was trying not to scrub the tyres. That's what it was. Just thought if I braked into the corner on the uh, on the tyres I was on in the gear I was in, we could have rolled through it, but it didn't want to, did it? Fishing the course is going to be pretty quick. Has somebody gone off up front? Sam and Fat Man together. Shoot by JB. No big popper it is now. Babies is sixth. Poppers in again on those mediums. So he's pitting every 11 minutes on mediums. That could that could net him quite a good result if he can just keep that rhythm up. No incidents. He could actually work that out to do quite well. Plenty of pit stops, but he'll have pace to keep it. I think he's out and away already, isn't he? Yeah, I think he's out and gone. So, I just have no pace. And I'm waiting for the wheel to, uh, to pack up again. It's a really good vibration through the wheel to tell me when it's sliding. I can't feel any vibration through the brake pedal, that's what oh, it must be. So BB's up to third. Eagles 
good 16 seconds ahead so he's doing well How far away will those balloons get in the hour, I wonder, or do they just hang about? Yellow flag, something's going on up ahead. Green flags now. Don't know who's had the incident. Would it have been Bald Eagle? Yeah, the, the gap's come down by eight seconds, so... 14 seconds down at six. He's had a little spinach. So, today I managed to get knocked out the schedule for the next 12 weeks. So I've planned out the next two weeks of off-season. I know exactly what we're doing, I'm going to announce that over the next couple of days. And then with the off-season, we're going to start the preparation for Le Mans. We're fully into it. We're only seven, eight weeks away from the Le Mans race. We really need to start getting people's mindsets into what car they're going to drive. A, well, before that, that they're actually going to take part in the event because we need some more takers. It would be really nice to get a good, strong field of races, of teams, Individuals is going to be well tough for people to try and do 24 hours. I, I know there's going to be a couple of people that are going to have to go and get their eyes down and just focus on. And if they can, if they can do the whole 24 hours, and that's what the uh, the channel is going to be trying to support those people as well who are doing the full 24 hour on their own, which is going to be phenomenal. It. it to be able to do that, knowing that you've got probably four or five hours of the day before the race, and then you've got to try and race a full 24 hour, doing it in one hour stints, and then taking the opportunity to go and take a pit, then go, to, go and take a break and get back into the seat and go again, will be just, oh, it's mind blowing that somebody could try that, but that's what it's about. So we're going to do a full season of GR1s and GR3s in the next league. I've planned out the tracks. We are going to finish with the league final a week before Le Mans race with a final race for one hour at Le Mans because we've got to get people conditioned into running that circuit. We're going to do it in GR1s and GR3s with the teams choosing their GR1 and GR3 car and I've got to, I've still got to do that this weekend I've got to put together the rules and requirements for the process so once I've got that done and I'll commit to do that this weekend I'll get that posted up for everybody to take a copy I need to put them in a place so uh Or I can email them out when people email me, one of the two. Because there are a few things we need to make sure people are aware of going into the event. So JB is 23 seconds ahead. I think that's going to be a full pit stop at this point. eight or nine laps to do on these bad boys. And then the weekend before Le Mans, 
on the Saturday. We've got three one-hour qualifying sessions for people to get their qualifying times in. And that's one driver from each team or whoever wants to join in that third session. I would advise people to get in and get qualified before the other sessions. Get them done and get them early, get them out of the way. But if there's three drivers from a team that want to take part, you're going to have to... Well, you don't have to go in each one in each session, but... It would be good to get booked in and get done. We'll see how that goes. I've just lost... I've just lost my wheel. Oh, and I've lost the car. Just as that happened. Oh, oh yeah, I'm... Uh, I'm in trouble. I need the... Uh... Oh dear. to look down to reach my controller. But my the old computer did alright, Sam's coming now, so sometimes I feel like I should just pull it over but I'm gonna keep going. I see Sam coming. He'll get me on the next straight. Sam's probably going to pit any time soon, to be honest. We're about to go to the brake balance thing. Well, we're not going to. Batman has dropped away from the back of um, Sam. Big Popper's gone to the pits again. He didn't, well, he has put in more laps this time. There's 27 to go, so we've got seven minutes to go before our next scheduled pit stop. according to this five it would be technically so let's see if we can burn that front tyre up over the next five laps front, the 
wheel has gone ever so light. such a shame see if I could get out without without getting a penalty and we did okay I just came in there too fast I wasn't really concentrating time's coming out again oh fat man's coming fat man takes up the lead that's epic surprised I'm not smoking that front left Fat man the inside line. Take it, fat man. Go, 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 me go. Go, go, go. I'll be slowing out your way. Go on. Tam's full in pursuit. So I can't afford to block Sam because that's Sam chasing him down. I've got to do my diligent race a bit here and make sure I don't interfere in this battle. The right thing to do would be go to the pit. I'm not even going to offer Sam a slipstream because that's not fair to... Uh, it's the fat man. Very difficult to read any of the chat. That is the week's finals, Marco. It's the last week of the GR4 League before we have a two week break then start the next league apologies it's final as in final final as in the championship the culmination the end of not the final as in the end Widowmaker quits streaming not that kind of final but that would be final but I thought about it but I'm not doing it Blooming hard, I tell you. It's not easy, it's not pleasant. But it's good fun. When you get into it. chase the Bishta down I think I'm about to go on to my last lap I'm on my last lap I'm pitting at the end of this one I 
Can't get it to stop nowadays. The wheels quitting out every 20 minutes, which is about what it pans out to. We will go back to the G29 if there's no fix. And we will... His tyres are nuked. What was that? Is that a... Oh, Darth Taffy. Darth Taffy just followed. Thank you very much. We're going to go head into the pits. We will not take a pit flyer. We normally do that, though, don't we? We won't do refuel. Oh, what time have we got left? Can't see a clock. 20 minutes remaining, so it's going to be 16 laps. That's what we need. Hopefully we don't finish this race in last place. Here we go, 16 and a half. We've got the fuel to go all the way at the end. That's where we're going. Who's this coming past? Is it Stefan? It's Stefan, so I'm in last place now. Taking the brake balance back to longevity of the front tyres. This is the battle I didn't want to be in, but I'll take it for any battle. gone to the pit but he's taken the fuel so as it stands we're a long way behind him and the battle is between me and Stefan here for the last place I just don't know where he is on his strategy I'm quite happy to uh Oh, he's going to let me go. We didn't have to. The battle was on. Stefan, a controller auto driver, who's just recently changed to controller manual. Very commendable to be able to try and do that. He'll reap the benefits of it, though. He'll get much quicker. seconds behind the bald eagle that's uh, representative of where we are today who's that down there Is that going to be BB putting me a lap down big poppers up to second epic job but I fear he's got to have one more pit stop but he stuck it out mediums seven or eight laps ago on the mediums hitting every time he's going to do like a five stopper turns out it'll be much quicker than my two stopper two stopper two crash hush hush I divide Is can we close in on Bald Eagle over the next 15 laps? Can we try? There's Big Popper. 
Oh, I don't know if that will be his last stop or whether he's got to make another one with 16 minutes to go. He probably has to stop twice. This one and one more. Just about to unlap for myself. He's coming out though, look, 44%. That's what he's doing, he's short fueling as well. He keeps in third place, that's, that's pretty decent though, look. Look at that, he's securing that. If he can go fast enough, as has bagged a pit stop as well. Bish is in seven, he's doing all right, look. That's where we should have been. Well, technically, without these wheel failures, we would have been well, undefinable where we'd have been. We wouldn't have done this strategy anyway, that's for sure. We tried to keep it on the track. Bish has just left the circuit and I think Bish is going to I don't know what Big Popper slowed for did he hit Big Bish don't know what's going on there come on Big Popper slide it on past you're way quicker than me don't know if he had an incident with Bish and he was trying to say sorry or wait for him to get back on. I don't know. He was lapping him, so Bish sort of moved out of the way. Bald Eagle there, 23-326 ahead. We're clawing him back, but I don't think we'll I don't think we'll be able to recover that. to cut back in to get to that apex really struggling on these tyres I couldn't have done 8 laps on mediums anyway not a chance I can only do 9 laps on hards
with two minutes five seconds down on Sam. Sam's leading, Fat Man in second. We've got somebody hooning down behind us, which I think is Bish. He's slowly gaining on us. Ooh, we're probably going to gain a bit quicker now as we have a jolly off in the dust. It is, Bish is coming back at us. It's for a place. I've lost the grip, front left tyre. Traction has gone. Don't know how much traction Bish has got, whether he's going to need to pit once more or whether he's got the run to be able to get past, I don't know. Got to do 10 minutes on this ultra cooked set of tyres. So the race is on between me and Bish now. My tyres are already done. How are his looking, I wonder? The start is his car is quicker than mine in a straight line. He seems to be taking a much wider, smoother line, doesn't he? Which is probably helping with his tyre wear. I'm now looking at my fuel and thinking, have I got enough? Batman's gone into the pits. 7.7 .7 laps of fuel, we've got enough. Batman had don't go off the track, you donut. Come on. I was looking at the positions. Batman's back out on track in third. Is Big Popper going to be able to go all the way without another stop and take second place? That's a great ask. That's going to be a good race at the front. I think JB's going to be in fourth. That means BB's going to be fifth as, third, as in sixth. There's the guess at this moment in time. Sam's come in for a final pit stop. I'm assuming he's far enough ahead to uh, to not really concern himself with whether Big Popper's going to come steaming in. But Big Popper's got the fastest lap of 118.450. That's brilliant. But Sam, of course, is putting the softs on now to come and pop in a 116 just at the end here to just try and take that back. I know I can't do a 118, so there's no point me putting on a set of softs and trying to do that. see if we can uh, catch any of these guys ahead whether they're going to take a pit stop or whether they're just going to drive to the end I don't know but only six minutes of this torture remaining Mariana would be doing a nutting See me burn these tyres away. Just 
should have pitted widow in the amount of time you're wasting I know I can't be bothered Big Popper has to go to the pits again we thought that would be the case but this is going to be a short fill is he going to go softs as well I'd go softs with just five minutes remaining Big Popper's going to put a big push on to try and get as many points to get up that ladder as he can he has he's gone for softs he's coming out as well there he is is fat man going to be forced into a a change in five minutes that's going to be three maybe four laps to go like Bish has had an incident didn't get any red flags but it definitely looks like he was slowed She's probably struggling on really, really worn out tyres. Bald Eagle's taking a pit stop. He's going to be far enough ahead. I'm not going to be able to catch the Bald Eagle. Not by a long way. He's gone to softs as well. Didn't need to take any fuel. He just changed tyres. This rate we have just three laps remaining. flags that is Sam he's already put the hot lap in so my race is lost that is for sure so regardless of what happens here hated the Willow Springs just like I hate Suzuka we're getting faster and there goes Bish it's JB that's catching us not Sam Come on, JB, move your anus. You're interfering with my race, man. The perfect strategy.
And there goes my wheel. Just the one more time. That's all we need, isn't it? Final lap. Is that going to give Bish the opportunity to come back and overtake me just before the line? Yeah, there's Bish now. Nothing I can do. The wheel, the wheel isn't even logged in. I'm going to lose that place now. And there's BB behind me, uh, just lost that place because of this wheel. I think I'm going to box it up and send it back to Fanatec, I think. I think it's going back. I don't think I'm going to persist with this. I'm going to get a refund and go to Logitech. I don't think I trust them as a supplier. I'll box the lot back up. Fed up with it. That up to completely. Can't get the chat app to unmute now. I don't know why. I don't know why, just the apps just decided to take a poop. Come on. It'll unmute, it won't do anything. I have to leave and then come back. No, it won't even let me leave. I'm going to quit it. Quit out of that. Ninth, cursed by a wheel. Join. I'm connecting. It says I'm already joined. Here we go. Oh, congratulations, everybody. There we have it. Save that replay for history's sake, but that's the end of that one. Won't be bad, won't be glad to see the back of that. But, uh, yeah, I think I'm done with this wheel and pedals. I think I'm done. I've got no, nothing left for it. It's as bad as anything else. Let's have a look at the results before I get on with making my returns claim. Good night, Sam. Good race. Adios, amigo. Take care. So I suppose it's filling out a returns thing, and it? it's uh,
No, I'm not in shock. I'm, uh, it's 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 no big feat to lap me at all, so I'm I won't take any offence by it. Don't don't. I'm just about to box it back up. Huh? Four. Yeah. It's going back. I've had enough. I'm just quit. I'm, I'm sending it back. I'm not putting up with it. I'm not waiting for a driver that is fictional to come. I'm not doing it. I'm, I've just had enough. Drivers should be the last thing. They should be... They should be a hot fix available for that. Immediately find out there's a problem. If they know the answer, I don't know why they're waiting for a two-week package. I don't know why. They've been talking about a fix for the last eight weeks. Well, here's the thing, right? Big Papa said to me, you need to tighten the clamps up on the front of your, your wheel. Because it's the same problem that he was having and a lot of other people are having. This is a fully redesigned front end. But it's the same problem. So it's not the clamp, it's inside the wheel that the problem is. It's not a driver, I'm sure they're just pissing people off. It's just, it's just bullshit. No, there's no feeling to it. It does it itself. You've got a, you've got a, a it's, 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 nothing. It's got, it's got six, eight, ten, twelve, fifteen pins, and inside, and inside the um, wheel, it's got two automatic levers that, as you put it on, it sucks it onto. It sucks it onto the collar. You you don't you don't do any plugging in it. Does it itself? It sucks it on. It's like there is no wires. It's it's fifteen pins. So either way, either way, I... Enjoy Cyprus, mate. Paphos or Ayanapa? Adios, amigo. Just fed up with it. Do it, man. This is true. Guys, I'm going to kill the stream. I'm going to go and get this stuff sorted and we'll see you on the next one. All the best. Take care.